everyone, welcome to Login Helps. I'm back with another video on how to record your Google Meet. If you'd like to record your meeting session so that you can use it for a later purpose, then keep watching the video till the end. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you've not yet and also press the notification bell icon so that you'll never miss another update from us. In order to record your meeting session on Google Meet, you'll need to download an extension. Open up a web browser, go to Google extension in the search box, make a search. On the next page, click on this Chrome Web Store Google Chrome link at the top. Soon after you do that, you'll end up in the Chrome Web Store. In the search box at the upper left, type in Screen Recorder, enter. In the search results that has been displayed on the screen, click on this first option. You can also use any other screen recording extension if you want, but in my case, I'm going to choose this one. Click on that and on the next page, click on Add to Chrome to add in the extension on your web browser. In the pop-up at the top, click Add Extension one more time and you'll be able to see your extension being downloaded at the top right. Once the extension has been downloaded, you'll be able to see it popping up at the display at the top. You'll be welcomed and thanked for installing the Chrome extension. On the next page, you can now simply close this tab. Now simply go to meet.google.com Log into your Google account if necessary to end up in this page. Now, as you can see that the extension has been highlighted in blue, which means this has access to your site. If the screen recorder is not available, then you'll be able to see it grayed out. If you don't find the extension at the top toolbar, then you can simply click on this puzzle icon and then click on this three dots right next to the extension that we just installed. Now, click on show in toolbar to get it on your toolbar at the top. Now go ahead and start a meeting that you'd like to record. From the home page, click on new meeting or you can also go ahead and enter a code or a link if available. In my case, let me click on new meeting. You'll be able to see several options in the pop-up. You can either create a meeting for later, start an instant meeting or schedule in Google Calendar. In order to show it to you right away, let me click on this start an instant meeting option. Now, once you're done on the next page, you'll be able to see this pop up at the upper left, adding other people that you'd like to invite to your meeting by clicking on add others and selecting the contacts that you'd like to conduct the meeting for. You can also go ahead and share this link to the contacts so that they can join in. After you're done and the participants has joined into the meeting, all you need to do in order to record your meeting is to go ahead and click on this extension at the top toolbar. Once clicking on that, you should receive this expanded menu. Click on record video at the bottom and select whether you'd like to record the browser window, your entire desktop or an application. In my case, I'm going to choose this browser window. Now go ahead and select if you'd like to record your mic sound and the tab sound as well. To do so, enable the button right next to each options. Allow access to your microphone by clicking on allow at the upper left and that way you'll be able to record your meeting. Once you're done with your meeting, simply leave the call and that way you'll be able to record your meeting using the extension. Recording your meeting will help you in many ways. You can make sure no one misses a meeting. By recording your meeting, you can make sure no detail gets lost or forgotten or simply use the meeting required later on if needed. That is how it is done. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If you did, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Comment down in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'm sure to be back with more tutorial episodes again. Thank you for watching.